Hello guys, welcome to your weekly general reading for those of you born under the sign of Cancer. Whew. Been a long day for Zodiac sign readings today. Hope you all are doing well. And we are going to ask, what can Cancer hope to be happening? What do they need to see happening? What kind of guidance, support, or advice do we have for our Cancers out there? And I'm going to have to be a little quick because my battery is running low. So let's get this going. Cancer energy. Give us cancer information. What do they need to know? What kind of guidance and support advice do cancers need? Let's see here. Working very, very, very hard. Waiting on something. Trying to get your balance. You've been stumbling. This could be in work. Yeah, some of you might have lost your job and you're trying to, or you're trying to change jobs. Um, I do see that happening here. Waiting for something. Maybe you're waiting for a phone call to get a job. You're waiting to see if it's going to come in. Uh, let's see here. Whew. I do feel like you're going to be hearing something pretty, pretty, pretty soon. Okay. Um, I feel like you're going to be able to get yourself back on your feet. This is something that you've been anticipating, something that you really, really love and you really want to do. Um, it's something that you've actually been learning and trying to promote and trying to, uh, you know, get higher up. I feel like you're cutting through. You're finally getting there. The, you're coming full circle with that. Okay, so it's like it's your time now. You've put in the time. You've put in the effort. It's time now. It's going to happen for you. It's just I feel like you've been a little bit stubborn. You, some of you might not be moving fast enough. Some of you might have given up and you're just not looking for work right now. You're just kind of like, oh, I'm not going to be good enough. And oh, and you have all these doubts and you're trying to just kind of sit back and just kind of wallow in self-pity and things like that. But I do feel like if you get a move on, if you really push yourself, I feel like a lot of you will be able to find what you're looking for. For the rest of you, I do I do feel that you're you're going to be hearing very very soon. You're putting in that work, you're putting in that effort. It's going to pay off. Oh, I see some communications coming in, movement. I see travel as well, possibly even moving, relocating. For some of you, I see you, um, yeah, signing a new contract, getting together, um, coming coming together in a partnership of some sort. This could be in relationship, but it could be in your career. So yeah, for some of you, that's going to be coming in very, very uh, meticulously and quick. I feel like that's going to happen this week or this definitely in the next couple of weeks. Um, some of you here may even be getting married, maybe entering a brand new relationship. I do see that here as well. Uh, I feel like you're a little bit shy. There's a little bit of things that you might need to speak up, okay? And that's not in regards to the relationship. I feel like that's more in regards to the work and financial situations and uh, applications that you're making. You might want to step up, show your boss um, who you are, let them know you're there, be in the spotlight because I feel like you're kind of in the shadows and they're not really, you're not really letting yourself be seen. So you need to come out. You need to come out of those shadows. I see victories here as well. Like I said, you guys are, you guys got this. If you want it, it's there. All you got to do is just go for it. Reach for those stars, put in the effort and it's so going to be worth it. For some of you, I feel like you've been in that, um, not working for quite a while. Things just kind of came crashing all around you. You've had a run of bad luck, but I feel like you need to stop wallowing in it because some of you have just kind of planted your feet down and you're kind of like, oh, I'm just going to give up. I'm being stubborn. And if you stay there, you're definitely not going to move forward like everyone else in the, uh, for the zodiac sign. Okay. So there's hope. There is. You just have to get up your bum and get it going. Because, yeah, I mean, that's what I'm seeing for a lot of you out there. Get those communications going. Um, for some of you, I feel like you're a little bit emotional. You're letting a lot of your emotions come through. It's not a bad thing. 
Um, but you do want to be careful with that. Okay, kind of gather yourself. Be careful how you approach things, how you say things, how you present yourself as well. Be firm, be uh, straightforward, especially when looking for work and you know, having interviews, things like that. You want them to know that you're someone they can count on. I definitely see that you guys are got you guys got this. I have really good energy coming from this for a lot of you. Okay, so I'm going to ask for more guidance from the fairy cards because I feel like this is pretty cut and dry here. So what else can our Cancer Zodiac signs see? What other information or guidance, further advice do we have? Okay, so this is the card here that came up. Ace of Winter. It says, don't be deterred by challenges along the way. It's important to communicate clearly and accurately amazing new ideas that should be implemented. Like I just finished telling you, you have to be seen. You have to come out. You have to be, be heard because you've got amazing ideas. Don't be deterred by those challenges that, you know, you've had that tower come down and now you're feeling sorry for yourself. You lost your job, whatever like that. It's going to pass. It's going to pass. Don't be deterred by challenges. I'm going to read this again along the way. It's important to communicate clearly and accurately amazing new ideas. You have amazing new ideas and they should be implemented. They should be spoke out. You should not hide. Okay. So that is your general reading, Cancer. Let me know how that resonates with you guys in the comments below. And thank you guys for watching.